I was asked by a fellow Redditor to show uh, off a script that I wrote that spreads up to 12 videos across my three monitors. So I'm making a quick video to show that here. And I'm not using a screen capture device, I'm just using my handheld camera. So I wrote this script called Film Wall Pi. Film Wall Pi. It's a Python script. It imports OS time and sys. Uh, all of this crap is just experimental stuff I didn't finish plugging in. <clears throat> and then it uses OS environ to get the Nautilus script selected file paths uh, environment variable, which is filled by selecting scripts and then uh, running filmwallpy through this scripts extension deal. If you open the scripts folder from there, you can see I've got a mounter thing for mounting CDs and for ISOs and film wall pie here, which is this. <clears throat> uh, so it grabs the names of the files you've selected and the full paths to them, splits them by their new lines, and then I just loop through them. Uh, and actually, first I create a file called film tile ds, which is a devil script or devil pie script. Devil's Pi is a utility that allows you to write DS scripts that will look for certain windows to open and then if they match it'll do whatever you said you want to happen to those windows like make them go full screen or place them in certain places. So I create in dot devil's pie in my home space a film tile DS and then I loop through and I write out all of um, write out these commands which are similar to Lisp or Scheme commands for matching those windows. It undecorates them, which takes off the title bar and the frame around it. So it's just the movie, nothing else. And it puts it above everything else. Then uh, it sets the geometry to the uh, size of one quadrant of my screen. My screens are 1280 by 1024, and I have three of them. They're 19 inch Dell flat panel monitors. <clears throat> So it makes them one quarter the size of one monitor and then it moves them to a changing offset of X and Y. I keep adding up X and Y. Uh, X, and if X falls over the limit of my screen, I add to Y and bring X back. So basically it will put windows across the top and when it hits this edge, it'll jump back and put the remaining six across the bottom like that. If I don't select 12, it'll stop wherever it lets off. So if I did 8, it would go to here. <clears throat> um, it puts a little delay in here because it needs time for the window to pop open and for this thing in the mplayer command to replace the name of the window with the name of the file, uh, which allows Devil's Pie to find it. And some other crap in there. There's a thing in here. Uh, I'm using WMCTRL, the uh, window manager control I think it is, to act, uh, to loop through these windows during the loop um, and to focus them, which I think I do simply to al allow Devil's Pie to find them. I, f I forget. If I didn't have that in there, it didn't work. It used to make sense. Maybe it makes sense to you listening. At the end, I just close it up. <clears throat> I sleep for a second to give everything time to settle down. There's some unfortunate race conditions and things that happen here where if I don't put in 0.6 seconds here between opening each one and one second after closing this file up that I'm writing the devil's pie file, then it doesn't work right and I'll get some of them won't move to the right place or none of them will move. They'll all stay centered on the middle screen. But... <clears throat> So that makes it so if the videos are all very short, like three seconds, it's not going to work because all the delays mean they all end before they have a chance for Devil's Pie to fire up on this line and, and run that film tile DS that we've been adding to. But once it all works, um, basically, I can show you a video here. This is a bunch of sim links to videos I made while turning a bowl on my lathe. So, this is a sander tool. Here it is, sanding. 
So if I select all of these, these are sim links because I had a large folder of videos and I picked 12 longer ones out of it. I can right click, go to Film Wall Pi, and it will pop them all open on the center screen with 0.6 seconds delay in between. And then once they all open, it'll just spread them everywhere. <clears throat> now my screens are 1280 by 1024, but the movies are 640 by 480, which means that the height would need to be 512, but it's 480, so you can see a little space in between them, and they don't cover the panels, because the movies aren't big enough. But And when they finish, they just wink out of existence as the movie player disappears. So, that's all there is to it. And of course I can just hit escape to close them. Although I lose focus at some point, so I go around and just click on them. And then I can escape. That's it. If I don't open enough, like say I open this many, <clears throat> it'll pop open that many, and then they will fill, try to fill the top row. And yeah, I only picked enough to fill the top row. This is a glitch that happens once in a while where one movie won't move to the right place and instead the window that I launched things from gets undecorated and moved into that place. I'm still trying to track that down. It happens randomly and not all that frequently. We got unlucky. So that was another reason I wanted to make a sim link for this so I could just pop it back open from the desktop. So that's it. Alright. By the way, this is, uh, I've measured this with a tape measure from one edge all the way over to the other edge it is 48 inches and it actually is very similar to the width of my desk. Which is kind of cool because when I sit here and look at the middle screen, I have ton of peripheral vision to either side of me. So probably I'm going to be doing a video eventually just on the three monitors and all of the stuff I've added um, to make it kind of a cool Ubuntu Linux setup. Um, I very much enjoy using it. I've been on PCs since 1992. It's 2009 right now. Um, I've had a stint with a Macintosh for a while years ago. And this is my favorite system so far. It doesn't do everything, it's not perfect. I've not been on any system I consider perfect. But this is by far and away my favorite setup so far. So, until next time.